Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to install any Wi-Fi drivers without internet in a Windows 11 PC or laptop. It is a very easy and simple process. Before go to the, our video, if you not subscribe the channel, then subscribe the channel and also click on the bell icon. So let's go to our video. First, first step is very simple. We are going to the device manager. That is very easy. Go to the start. Right click on the start. Here we find device manager. Click on the device manager. In a device manager, we find many options. And here is most IMP option is network adapter, expand network adapter. And here we find the our wireless network or the Wi-Fi device or the Wi-Fi. Select your Wi-Fi. Right click on the your Wi-Fi. And here we find properties. Click on the properties. In a properties, click on the details. Click on the details. In a details, here we find properties. Here we find device description. Click at device description and click on the hardware IDs. Click on the hardware IDs. In a hardware IDs, here we find value. In a value, select the first value. Select the first value. Whatever first value is, select the first value. I select the first value. Right click on it and click on the copy. Copy the first value. Click on the OK. Close it. And next step is go to start. Type notepad and click on the notepad. And here, paste this value. Paste this value at here. Paste whatever value at here. Paste that value at here. And go to the file and click on save as. And save on the desktop with any name. I say with Wi-Fi. You can save it with any name. I save it with the Wi-Fi. I click on the Wi-Fi. Save it and close it. And here is the our Wi-Fi text. Okay. I close it. It is the our Wi-Fi text. Our next step is we are going to the another PC. My PC has a not working internet. So go to the next or any other PC or laptop, Mac PC, Windows PC or Android or any device that you want. Go to the any device that has a working internet and download the our drivers. We are going to the next step to download the our drivers. For that, I go to the, this PC. And I attach my USB drive to my PC. I attach my USB drive to PC, USB drive or pen drive to my PC. Double click on it and drag this file to here or copy and paste this file at here. I copy it, right click on it and copy it or drag this file and paste or uh, paste this file at here. Paste it at here. Okay, paste it at here or drag and drop it here and close it and next method is or next step is I go to the another PC that has a working internet. So I go to the next step to the working internet PC. This is the my PC and my internet is working absolutely working. You can choose Android mobile or any PC or laptop and go to the this PC. I'm going to the this PC in this PC here. I attach my pen drive. I attach my pen drive. So I my pen drive is attached attached now to my PC. Double click on it and double click on this Wi-Fi file name, double click on it and it's open, I minimize it, go to here and copy this value, copy this value and go to the any web browser that you want, I'm going to the Google Chrome, you can go to the any web browser and here type driver pack solution, here type driver pack solution, type this driver pack solution and hit enter key on your keyboard. First link is from the driver pack. Open the first link. Here we find the official website of the driver pack. Click on this link or the driver search. Click on the driver search. In a driver search, click at here and paste the output value. Control B or paste the our value. This is the our value. Paste this value at here. Whatever value, paste it at here and click on the find. And it's fine. You were drivers on the driver pack site okay but one problem here we find dri install driver automatically it is a full software of this drivers or the driver pack we don't don't need this so i go to the here here we find our operating system in this in many cases windows 11 drivers are not available with the our wi-fi in this case same thing or same problem i click on the windows 11 64 bit windows 11 is always 64 bit 64 bit is most imp i click at here and here we find driver pack is not available for our windows 11 don't worry we can solve this in the next step go to the pack and here click on this operating system 
and select any operating system that has a 64 bit operating system select any operating system with x64 or 64 bit select windows 10 8 c1 or 8.1 select any operating system with 64 bit 64 bit drivers are working with the all windows operating system i click on windows 10 64 bit and don't go to the this link also don't go to the these three links these are the software link of the driver pack. Scroll down and find this link. This is the our link and this is contain the our drivers. Click on this link, whatever this link is, click on that link and our download is started and it's complete. Here we find our download is completed. Click on show in a folder, minimize it and drag this setup file to desktop, close it and minimize it. Next step is copy this file or drag and drop this file on the our pen drive double click on the our this pc our pen drive this is the our pen drive or usb drive double click on it and drag this file select this file or right click on it and copy it and paste it at here or drag this file to the our usb pen drive okay and close it and now go to the your main machine that has a problem with the wi-fi I'm connect to the my main PC or the PC has a problem with the Wi-Fi and I go to the this PC, I connect my USB, I go to the this PC, my USB connected, go to the my USB drive, double click on it or pen drive and drag this setup file or the driver files from this, drag this setup file from the our USB pen drive and drag it to the our desktop, close it, here is the our file, right click on that file, click on show more options and click on extract files click on the extract files and click on the okay or you can also right click on it and extract all both are same i double click on this newly created folder double click double click double click and double click and here we find our drivers close it and we are going to install these drivers files manually that is very easy and simple go to the start right click on the start here we find device manager click on the device manager click on the device manager in a device manager, I make it center, go to the network adapters, expand network adapters. Here we find the our Wi-Fi or the Wi-Fi card or the wireless network or Wi-Fi. Select that Wi-Fi, right click on it, click on the update drivers, click on the browse my computer for drivers. Here we find path, select this include subloader, it is an very IMP and click on browse, go to the desktop, go to the desktop, inner desktop, here is the our file, double click on it. Click on the OK, it's automatically uh, go to the subfolders, click on the OK, click on the next. It's install our drivers, if latest drivers is available then it's installed. In my case, my latest drivers is already installed. So it is not installing, in your case it is all automatically installed and click on the close, go to the next, next and it is automatically installed. After that, go to the control panel, if it's not working then go to the control panel, click on the control panel go to the network and sharing center change adapter settings and here we find wi-fi is not connected then go to the here make sure it is this it is connected and after that it is not disabled then go to the here on a taskbar click at here and here click on this wi-fi and connect to your wi-fi click on the next now our Wi-Fi is connected, our internet is on, check our internet is working or not, go to the any web browser that you want, here type anything that you want, I type Google and here we find our Google is running, that means our search engine is running, that means our internet is 110% working in our Windows 11 PC, our Wi-Fi problem is solved. So guys, thank you for watching this video, don't forget to like, share Comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you guys.